what about Wimbledon? I mean, obviously London has changed dramatically over the years, um, and it's you know it's much more of an, uh, an urban place. Do you do you notice the change in, in it as a, as a city and as a place? Yeah, from from the time when we went there for the last four, five, six years in in the early '60s, it was a, some it was it was a, it was a quieter place. I think Wimbledon and and London, and I think that uh, you know what, there is a big change that I see now. You know, because you know all cities grow up and and it's there's there's more traffic around. Getting to Wimbledon now takes you 45 minutes, where it probably took you half that time to get out there during a, during a, the rush hour. But uh, no, I I I've always enjoyed going to Wimbledon, and uh, and as as I was there three or four years in the past and had some good wins. You know, all of a sudden, you, you, it reminds you of the game of tennis, because that, to me, is where it starts. I think it's the number one player. What number? It's, it's the number one tournament in the world, and uh, you know, mainly, be, mainly because the it's the audience, it's the facility, it's it's the respect that the, the crowd have for you, for the players, and so you know, everybody wants to go to Wimbledon. And I think that's their biggest thrill is to, to win Wimbledon or to do well at Wimbledon. And I think, uh, you know, that's some of the changes that uh, have happened, of course, you know, with, with putting a roof on the centre court and making it bigger and adding more courts, having a, a new centre one, a number one court. There's so many things they've done. You know, I remember when we used to come through the, ma the main gates that we used to be driven by either a Bentley or Rolls or those big ones and the probably six or seven pit players would be picked up at, in London and driven out there and you know they'd 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 come through the the, the rolls would come through the center through the gates and then stop right there at the Royal Box entrance and let you out because the men's dressing room was on the left side as you walked in and the ladies were on the right side and so you know lots of changes but it was more intimate and today you yeah, it, it, you, you could never do it that way, but it's it's one of those things that uh, you know progress.